Okay, so on today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to use OpenVINO AI with Audacity. Uh, now, this is not the most optimum method. This method is, uh, I just followed some steps I found of the internet. So if you know a better way, please let me know. So we actually have to use the Audacity version from the Snap package. So right now I'm using uh, Arch Linux, uh, catchy OS to be exact. So uh, I'm using catchy OS. Uh, so first you have to do is you have to uh, install Snap. So I have made a text to uh, help you guys follow the steps. So the first step would be to uh, install snap so uh, let's begin i guess so step one is installing snap so if you're on arch you have to use uh, a helper like yay or peru uh, if you don't have a uh, yay or peru you can just uh pseudo pacman sorry pacman and uh, install yay or uh, Peru, which one ever you like, uh, the comments are saying. I have a uh, yay by default, so I will be using yay. So first you have to use install snap and use it by, by a yay. So. And if you are on any other system like Ubuntu or Fedora, you have just to use sudo apt install snap. So the next step would be to install, install audacity. To get the snap package now why do we have to use the snap package to be exact so uh, for some reason the snap version of the audacity comes default with uh, the plugins now it comes default with the plugins but the actual ai models that help us with the different tasks doesn't come with that and we have to install it manually if you are on amd but uh if you're on Intel, it's a different story. So if you have like a GPU or NPU for uh, for your for your laptop or your PC, you can install the Intel NPU drivers. You can install this from Snap. You don't really need to use Snap packages if you want for installing the NPU driver. But unfortunately, on my uh, laptop, I do not have any uh, NPU or GPU. I am using integrated. Uh, graphics what we have to do next is uh install this snap version i'm gonna i'm gonna show you so uh uh i have already installed snap so it doesn't install anymore so the next thing we have to do is uh, get this package a uh, git and get lfs so git lfs is used for uh installing downloading hugging face packages uh, we have to install this using Pac-Man if you're on Arch. So I'm on Arch, I'm going to use this. Uh, so it will just take a minute and to install it. Now if you're on Ubuntu or you're on Debian, you have to use uh, sudo apt install git lfs. Now uh, if uh, I don't uh, I don't actually know that if you're, if you're on Debian, you have to use an extra keyring or something. I don't really know, but if you have to do, uh, please let me know in the comment section. I will probably... Uh, uh, add it into the description to uh, how like uh, get the L get LFS. Now on the on this video, I will only be showing you how to get the uh, the open Vino uh, noise suppression tool. So so I will be uh, closing this. I'm gonna be only uh, getting the noise suppression tool. So I press en enter, and uh, it will just download all the defilter open Vino stuff. So uh, it has, it seems that it has installed it. So what we have to do is uh, just simply, okay, so what do you have to do next is uh, just use the unzip command. So if you don't have uh, the unzip command, you just install it. sudo pacman uh, unzip and you install it. If you don't have unzip by default. Now, uh, what you do next is uh, you just, you just use this command and you just uh, now uh, I already have uh, I already have uh, unarchived it once so I will just pressing uh, to no uh, any 
anyway so uh, it just uh, un it just extracted all the far right files and now what you have to do is copy it to a specific folder now what you can do is uh, you can use this one command line to uh, get the pseudo mode working in uh, KDE because in KDE you, you cannot just use sudo and uh, type out dolphin so you can open it with dolphin so I'm just gonna open dolphin with the root uh, I'm just gonna give it my password uh, you have to go to your uh, var folder there you go and you have to uh, you have to like go to the snap folder and uh, audacity and common and models now if you don't have this folder just make it just uh, make a folder and name this so uh, I have like installed the filter net 2 by default so uh, not by default I've just uh, installed it so what you do is uh, I'm gonna delete this to show you guys that uh, I don't have it or I don't have the files right now um, why is it not deleted okay it's not it's it's deleted so what I have to do is uh, I just go to the home and uh, I just go to the home and I uh, go to the folder that I extracted. So this is the folder. So these are the files. So uh, I have to copy this. Uh, I gotta cut this into uh, over here. Now uh, inside this, there's nothing. So I'm gonna paste it. Paste one folder and uh, it pasted. Now what I have to do is uh, go back. Um, that's my new one. So to go back and just copy this or cut it and I paste it in the in this folder. So uh what this is now your now uh the folder net two and three is done. Now I'm gonna show you uh how you can uh simply just uh, use a file and use it in Audacity. What I do next is uh, I'm gonna show you a demo. A, a file and I'm going to open it now uh, this file doesn't really have any noises uh, so what I will do this is for like just showing uh, uh, so what it does is like you go to the noise suppression and we press on it you can uh, select from the, one of these two and uh, you can just apply now it will take time if you have like a, a longer uh, clip or you're using it on a CPU uh, it's an it's not a like huge intensive task, but uh, it it still takes a bit time. So this is how you work. Uh, this is how you get noise suppression working. Uh, Open Vanilla AI noise suppression working with Audacity on Linux. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching this tutorial. Uh, if you want to watch a more tutorial like this or Linux stuff like this, uh, please. Uh, subscribe to this channel and uh, if you like this video please like it so it goes up on the youtube recommendations uh, thank you guys bye so this is how it sounds when you, when i don't use the open reno ai and this is how it sounds when i use the open reno ai